Namaste all my viewers. Welcome to my YouTube channel for wellness. I'm Nilakshi. I'm a Reiki master clinical hypnotherapist and access bars practitioner tarot reader. Today I will be beginning a seven day series to help you release anxiety and its root causes. This seven day series is supposed to aid in the release of anxiety. However, it is not a replacement for medication but it can be used along with your medication to speed up the results. Before opting for or getting off any medication, please check with your doctor. Make sure you're using this video at home when you're not being disturbed. Do not use it while operating heavy machinery or driving. Today we'll begin with this first day of the series. For this series, I would require you to get a small pebble or even a crystal like I have this one that you can hold in your hand for next seven days. From there, every day we will begin working on one chakra. So today being the first day, we will work on the root chakra. The root chakra is responsible for our stability and security. It helps us feel grounded and connected to the world around us. It also takes care of our financial, our material, our physical world. And in case we are feeling a little uncentered, it is usually because the root chakra is not balanced. Root chakra is red in color. And today we will work on releasing any negativity or tightness stored in our root chakra. You begin with holding your pebble, small rock or crystal in your right hand. Put it in a fist and put the hand in your lap. From there, you'll close your eyes and allow me to guide you and your mind into a peaceful, relaxing state. Take a deep breath in and hold it. And exhale, and as you exhale, exhale from your mouth and relax your back. Take another deep breath in and hold. Let it circulate in your body and exhale and relax. Draw in another deep breath and this time take that breath to your lower abdomen and legs. Hold it and relax. Now I want you to take your attention to your right leg, your ankle, your thighs, the muscles and bones in this area and relax this area completely. Observe any tightness in your left leg, left knee, ankle, calves, thighs. And as you take a breath out, relax and release this completely. Drawing in deeper breath now. Take your attention to your lower back, your spine, your hip, your gentle area. Breathing in light and peace in this area. And as you exhale, relax and let it fall easily and gently on the surface where you're resting. Now observe your stomach in your upper abdomen, your kidney, your liver, the intestines. And as you exhale, relax and release this area completely. Now take your attention to your chest, your lungs, your rib cage, breathing in. And as you exhale, relax this area, letting your shoulders drop down, your rib cage relaxed, and the muscles around your rib cage falling down and down. Now take your attention to your neck, your collarbone, the shoulders. Observe any heavy weight that you had been carrying for years, months, days. And as you exhale, relax and release anything that is holding on to you. Now take your attention to your right arm palm, your fingertips, 
observe any tightness, heaviness in this area. And with your next breath, relax and release it. And let it fall down into your lap and observe the change in weight of both your arms. And now take your attention to your left arm. Again, breathing in light into all of your palms, your arm, your elbow, muscles and bones of the arm. And as you take your next breath out, relax and release this. Feel your body going down and down and down with the gravity. And now take your attention to your neck, your vocal cords, relaxing the muscles around this area. And now take your attention to your jaw, releasing the tightness in the jaw, unclench your jaw. Relaxing your face, your eyes, your head, your scalp and let it relax completely and easily. Feel the blood flow in your body. Feel the calmness in all your muscles. And I want you to take your attention at the base of your spine and the center of your hip. This is your root chakra. It is red in color and ideally it should be spinning clockwise giving you a feeling of bursts of energy that stabilize your physical materialistic well-being filling you with security and stability. Observe the color of this chakra. If this chakra seems stuck, dark or murky, then begin to connect more and more with this, seeing whatever visuals it allows you to see. You need not judge any of these visuals or actions that you are seeing. Just connect with this chakra. We will now chant a mantra that has the power to release deep-rooted issues in any of our chakras and help us regain the balance that we were born with. As you chant this mantra, visualize that all the heaviness, the dark and murky energy stored in the root chakra is getting transferred to the rock that you're holding in your hand, releasing, transferring all that stagnant energy into this rock for release, that is, for your highest self. We shall chant this chakra seven times, taking in a deep breath, repeat with me, Ahim. Ahim 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 relax and now I want you to visualize a beautiful bright white light right in front of you soaring breathe in this energy into this root chakra and with every breath that you take visualize that the base of your spine is now active. Those who know how to apply a mulabandh can also start doing that now. And breathe in 
this white beautiful energy and fill yourself with the affirmations. I am now connected to the world. I am powerful. I am worthy. I am grateful for all that I have. I am established in my power. I am balanced. I let go of anything that makes me feel insecure. For insecurity is an illusion. I know my strength that lies within me and I have access to that power. I allow my root chakra to spin wonderfully, clearing all the nerves around my lower abdomen, my hip, my gentle area, letting energy flow freely and fully. Breathe in this energy into the base of your spine. Energy flows freely and fully through my lower abdomen, into my legs, into my feet, grounding me, connecting me to earth and all beings connected to earth. I feel like a part of this big universal family and as I walk every day on this earth, I get charged with the power of earth that is soaring into my body. I constantly renew my energy as I walk. I let go of anything that is no longer serving me using my right leg, using my right foot and with every step taken with my left foot I regain a recharged, a refurbished, a beautiful energy back from earth. Every step that I take is helping me walk on a path that makes me feel more stable, more secure, more connected with myself and everyone around me. And any moment that I am not able to see its full power, I can chant the mantra Ahim and re-energize myself. Draw in a deep breath, storing all these thoughts in your subconscious mind for wonderful execution. And now once you're done, connect with that rock once again that you're holding in your hand. Ask that rock to keep absorbing any energies in your root chakra that need to be released. Help that rock to let that energy get transferred into it for your highest good, releasing anything that is no longer serving you any good or providing any useful lessons. And now, slowly bring your consciousness back, bring your awareness back into your body, into your legs, into your back, into your spine, your chest, your arms, elbows, your face. Breathe in, taking a deep breath, and as you exhale, allow yourself to get recharged with this energy. Slowly wiggling your fingers and your toes, bringing your awareness back into your body. And using this to benefit you even after this session is over. With a smile on your face, welcome back. And now, just keep this rock or crystal, whatever you have used today as your totem, keep it by your bedside and allow it to continue absorbing any energy that is no longer serving you. Check back tomorrow for the next exercise. I wish you good health and good life. Namaste.